Hi, video that you're going by. I'm going to put you on YouTube and tell everybody you're too famous to stop being little old me. Yeah, what is? You're looking good all the way, Cali. Had some snow in Flagstaff, but I suspect it's raining now. Uh, have a good man. Ron, this is dispatch. YouTube, Buck Rub here. What well, is 930 at night and I made it as far as Amarillo, Texas. I wasn't able to make it all the way back to the terminal and it's a little late. They close at 11. But I'm going to grab me an Uber. I'm going to head over to the Beck, Texas Steak Ranch and have me a steak. It's Big Texas Steak Ranch. I'm going to go in here and uh, have me a steak. They close at 11. It's a little late here. I didn't realize it. Uh, there's truck parking. If I would have known that, I'd have parked my truck here and not gone to the Loves. I'm gonna go inside and eat. What would a giant steakhouse be without a uh, big giant dinosaur with cowboy boots? and a big old bull out front. <laughs> I've ate here before. Let's go see how it is tonight. Well, there's one thing they may not mention about trucking. That's the time you miss for the holidays. This is the first New Year's Eve me and my wife have been apart for 29 years. But I was unable to make it back to the terminal. So I parked over at the Loves across the street. I'm at the Big Texas Steak Ranch. So I had me a steak, baked potato, salad, and a little bit of adult beverage. Came over here in an Uber, but they're gonna take me back in a limo. But for those of y'all that ain't been here, it's pretty empty right now. It's usually packed when I come in here. But it's a stop. Pretty damn. Cool place. This place is pretty cool. It's got a it's got a bar, a game room, a shooting gallery, a little store with cheesy tourist crap. And I'm gonna go outside and find my limo. I just feel like, yeah, looks like he's loaded up and heading out, so I'll, I'll catch the next one. Limo's here. What would a limo in Texas be without a set of bullhorns on the front? Here's our driver. Who's our driver? Rod. Hi, Rod. You're on YouTube, Rod. Hey. Hey, this is Rod. He's going to take me back to Love's truck stop. <laughs> Well, I'm, uh, I'm back in my truck. I uh, had me a nice steak, baked potato salad, little drink. I uh, had a great waiter, his name was Big Mike. Uh, real nice fella, took real good care of me. Um, it's a nice, nice time. Hey, here's something to think about if you're thinking about getting into trucking is you're gonna miss, you're gonna miss holidays, you're gonna miss birthdays, you're gonna miss anniversaries, you're gonna miss a lot. It's something that you uh, that you just gotta deal with when you uh, when you decide that you're gonna be a trucker. Um, 
you know, this is, uh, it's New Year's Eve, and uh, this is the first time me and my wife have been apart in 29 years. Uh, she went over to my brother's tonight for a little get together, and, uh, and I'm real sorry I missed that. Um, so, but here I am in Amarillo, Texas, went over and had me a, had me a steak, you know, happy new year to me. But that's all right, you know, this company pays, it pays good money. Um, you know, when I was getting in the limo, there's another guy that's staying over at the TA. He drives for another company. I won't, uh, I won't mention the name, but let's just say we all give them a lot of crap on both the road and the, uh, and in the, uh, fuel islands. Um, he's been working for him for about a year and I mentioned what, uh, what I'm making per mile and the kind of miles I'm getting and, uh, and he kind of seemed amazed that that kind of pay was out there for a driver with our kind of experience. Um, so he may be looking into that as well. And hey, man, it was nice to meet you. Um, but uh, those are all things to think think about in trucking. But I'm gonna hit the I'm gonna hit the rack. And uh, hey, I want to wish you guys a happy New Year. 2016 was really rough for me. Uh, the end of 2015, most of 2016, it was all big changes for me. I'm looking for big things in 2017. Uh, Y'all be safe out there. Watch out for the nutcases that are out here drinking and driving. If you're out partying and drinking, please don't drive. Man, Uber's available anywhere. Maybe you won't get a limo back, but, uh, but somebody can give you a ride. If you've been drinking, don't get on the road, man. I want to talk to you tomorrow next year. I'm Buck Rub. Out.